Washington State Capitol. This is the old Capitol building. Check it out. Check out Olympia with us. Run the Atlas. Let's do this. So here you can see the green flag is the state of Washington's flag. They actually have Washington's picture on the flag, and this is the only state named after the first president. So impressions of Olympia so far, it's very quiet here. There's a lot of huge trees, beautiful coniferous trees here. As soon as I landed, I could smell the pine. We're going to try Burial Grounds Coffee. In Pacific Northwest tradition, we start our day with coffee at by far the creepiest and funkiest coffee shop. With specialties like rigor mortis or devil's lullaby, it's give me coffee or give me death. Okay, so we just went to Burial Grounds. She put a skull in our coffee and we got the Persephone. We have better coffee here than Starbucks. So we're in the downtown and this building is from 1882. Sweet. This is called the TJ Potter Alleyway. How cute this is. Olympia to Seattle. We have made it to Olympia. This is the capital of the state, state of, of Washington. Washington. We're right in between two national parks. Lakes forests, rivers. What more could you want? Great coffee. Cheers. Um, we're gonna get some seafood. We're gonna go kayaking. Join us. But first, we took a, a little tour of the historic downtown and the murals. Oh, more murals. We found more murals. Oh, look at this. Woo. independent bookstore that was founded in 1935. Armor Market. We're heading in, woo! We're to start. There's German food behind us, all kinds of crafts. Apples, apples, and more apples. We are in the apple picking state of Washington. Look at this little cozy area where you can go sit. It's so cute. We're at the very edge of the Puget Sound here in Olympia, right on the water. Little bit of sun popping out. Mike, what do you think? It's amazing, we love being here. Olympia is so cool. Fresh air, beautiful water. It's like being on a boat. Oh, right there. Woo. Cool. Baby, so they are known for oysters here. As you can see, it's very rocky. There's a lot of mussels on these poles here. And we are going to try the oysters at a place called Chelsea Farms. Chelsea Farms, let's go. Here. Gonna go get oysters. Woo. We are at Chelsea Farms. They're famous for their oysters. We just got the baked oysters and the stone fruit salad with peaches. Mike is trying the baked oyster. How was it? Cheers. This has tamarind whiskey sauce. And Asian pear. And Asian pear. This is the, the baked Chelsea. Geoduck oh, crudo. We hit the road to explore the surrounding areas of the Olympic Peninsula. About an hour away is the Olympic National Park, which contains dramatic peaks and old growth forests. 
On this trip, we ran into a little bit of weather, so we decided to cross the Tacoma Narrows Bridge and check out another nearby forest known for Bigfoot sightings. Whoa, this is rad. The skies cleared and the park opened up to beautiful 360 degree views of the Puget Sound. There's blackberries everywhere. During our hike, we keep an eye out for Bigfoot, the large, mysterious ape-like creature known to inhabit these wild, forested areas. Ooh, you can hear the train! Woo! We're in the forest, we're taking this really cool hiking path. Look at these views! Suddenly, I saw something appear through the clearing in the forest, and in a blink of an eye, it was gone. What better way to end the night than at a local craft brewery? We head to Well 80 Brew Pub, which is built on the site of one of Olympia Washington's famous artisan wells. The water from the well is said to make the beer especially tasty. We're at Olympia, Olympia Coffee. Coffee, and Mike just got a bergamo latte. BP's in the run the Atlas gear. After getting our caffeine fix, it's time to head to the Capitol building. Washington At the Washington State Capitol. Washington became a state in 1889, baby. We're gonna go check out the building. Look at these grounds. These are all the government buildings of Washington, and it really feels like a college campus or something. It's like we're in the quad but it's really beautiful. Mossy trees. George Washington can be seen throughout the stone carvings on the Capitol, which was built in 1911 and done in classical style. Nice walking paths along the Capitol area here, and it overlooks the Puget Sound. Puget Sound has over 1,300 miles of coastline. It's famous for orcas, killer whales. We're heading into the classic tugboat annie. This place is a classic. We got the Pacific Northwest salmon and clams. Yeah, local clams. Ooh, local clams. The view from Tugboat Annie's. After enjoying the views of the Puget Sound, it's time to get out there on the water and experience it ourselves with the kayak rentals. We are renting kayaks from Tugboat Annie's. All right, so we just got our kayaks and we are kayaking through the Puget Sound harbor area in Olympia. How was it, Mike? So relaxing. Oh, sea air feels so nice. Woohoo! BP's over here. We out here. This is such a great way to take in the beautiful scenery. There's not a lot of boats out here, so we're kind of just cruising. And it's so beautiful to get up close view of some of these beaches that you can only see from here. You can 
see all these houses right here along the Puget Sound. But the lady at the kayak said, these are all private beaches, so we can't land here unless it's an emergency. If you like these views as much as we do, be sure to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe down below. There's a seal right there. There's a seal. The Puget Sound is the third largest estuary in the United States after Chesapeake Bay and the San Francisco Bay. The waterways surround a number of cities, including Seattle, Tacoma, Olympia, and Everett. Now it's time to get back on dry land to hit up the hiking trails. Look at this beautiful area that we found forested with ferns. We are in this fern gully forest in Olympia. Look at this place. Just surrounded by trees. Hanging in This trailhead seemed to appear out of the blue, right outside of Tugboat Annie's, and it was like stepping into a magical storybook. We were completely surrounded by a canopy of trees, and it looked like a place where gnomes or elves would live. Now look. What is this? Hey guys, I'm in Olympia, I'm in this forest, filled with trees and ferns and leaves, moss. Look at this trail, oh my God. What? He's up in the ferns, look at this. Woo! Fall, baby. Now it's time to treat ourselves and head back to downtown Olympia for a special ice cream treat. So we just went to Sophie's Scoops here in Olympia. Cheers. I just got the Olympia Fog and Cardamom. Mm. And BP got mint chip. Oh my God. BP, how was it? Yummy. Yum. Woo. Oh my god, it's the best. Mm. The Olympia Fog has like rose petals and Earl Grey. It's so good. We are at the National Wildlife Refuge. They have a number of really beautiful flora and fauna here. Look at these wetlands. This is so interesting. Sasquatch. On our way north to the airport, we catch a glimpse of Mount Rainier, towering at 14,411 feet tall, the tallest peak in the continental United States. We hope that you enjoyed this video of Olympia and get a chance to visit very soon. Be sure to hit the thumbs up button, share with your friends, and subscribe for many more travel videos.